Hi Gemini, welcome back to your channel Gemini. It is always a blessing to have you guys back here. If you are here for your first time, I welcome you. And if you are returning Gemini, I welcome you guys back. We're going to pick some energies up, okay? Um, I did a pre-shuffle for you guys earlier and I did pick up your person's energy very, very strongly that they wanted to tell you something. They're having a hard time saying. We're going to find out what's happening here, okay? But before we get into that, just know that you're precious. Just know that you're a diamond. Continue to shine bright like a diamond. And if you're here for your first time, I welcome you. And if you are returning to my channel, I welcome you guys back. Let's get into a prayer, y'all. Tap into your energy and pull in your situation. Let's, let's break. <clears throat> <clears throat> Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and I ask that you bless my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading using my body as a vessel. Giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share, the ones that need to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all and all the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, so Gemini, Gemini, my darlings, just know that this reading is a general, is a general reading, not a personal one. It may or it may not resonate with you guys. Please take what does resonate with you at this moment and leave the absolute rest. You can pick up your person's energy, past person, present person, future person. Um, place your placement where they need to be placed, place the situation where they need to be placed, and place your placement where they need to be placed, okay? Cross watchers, same apply for you guys as well. Now, personal reading is available here on the channel. It is very simple to connect with me. The information is in the description of the video. If you text me, guys, you'll get me er you'll get me easier. <clears throat> I've been getting oh my goodness. Hold on, y'all. I'm thirsty. <clears throat> Hold on. And my water is done, too. I've been getting a lot of messages on Instagram. Yes, you guys can contact me on Instagram. But if you text me, you get in faster than you will on Instagram, okay? Go ahead and follow me there, though, all right? All right, so a uh, special is going on right now. You'll get a $55 read for 30 minutes. You'll get a $45 read for 20 minutes and a 10 minutes, three questions spread for $25. They will be ending June 30th, you guys. So go ahead and get on this special because it will not last uh, very long. All right, so let's get into some messages here <clears throat> and see what's going on with your person. What they want to tell you but can't. Is there a little secret that's going on here that you need to know about? Is there something lingering in the dark? Is this the reason why they've been giving you a little attitude lately? And you just can't put your finger on why? What is going on? Are you trying to tell me something is what that you're thinking? Or is these actions speak louder than words here? Let's see. Let's get some clarity on why and why it works. All right, angels, let's clarify these uh, messages and feelings and intuition, please. For Aries at this time. Ooh, denial. Okay. Let's see. What's going on with this denial here? That was the first card that came through. Hmm. Okay. So I'm hearing money issues is what I'm seeing here. Gemini. Your person is having some financial difficulties here, and they don't want you to know, right? They're definitely in denial about where their financial situation is going right now. I don't know if this person is not working or whatever the hell is going on, but they're having some serial denial here about you finding out how their financial ties are going, okay? Something is in the red here. Seriously, in the rain. Something is not going right or accordance here. Um, the money may be going elsewhere. This person at this time is not even trying to have you see their phone here because they don't want you to see that they are struggling with money. Maybe they have their, um, their bank app on their phone and they're not trying to have you go through your phone so you could check the app to see their balance in the account but what i am seeing here is an abuse abusive situation that's happened here for some of you guys you may be getting abused by this person 
I'm seeing somebody being abused. If it's not a physical abuse, it could be a mental abuse or emotional one. But someone is dealing with something that has attached itself to an abuse or this is how you may feel mentally. All right, clarify this, please. For Gemini at this time. Secret lovers. All right, so there's also a feeling of this person seeing someone else. Yeah, betrayal. All right, so this person is definitely connected to someone else. There's a third party involved here. For some of you, you might know about this betrayal already. Uh, maybe you're trying to kind of fix things or... Yeah, for some of you, are trying to fix things, but you're at your breaking point right now, even though you might definitely really try because i see you maybe you want to go out on a date or maybe they're asking you out on a romantic dinner or something to kind of talk things through but i see some of you wanting to move on here you're moving on you're moving on you want to move on here tell me more tell me more for gemini please what is going on with your situation with your person all right let's see more angels okay so someone took a risk here okay is what's really going on with your situation but this risk is also coming in as breaking point all right so for some of you guys you definitely know about this risk that your person took with the secret lover or this abuse or this is how they feel like they're abusing their power trying to be control trying to control you but there's, I feel like there's an unexpected visitor. For some of you, you may have a friend or a family, whoever this could be, that is a secret type of a person who this person is, your person maybe he slept with this person that you know about. An unexpected visitor, visitor. Yeah, this person broke your trust here. You trusted this person and your person slept with them or whatever this could be. I feel like there's either a feeling of being friends that might, you might have been friends with this person or this could be friends of them or both of y'all. Okay, but there's a lot of interaction here. This person may be, may be connected to them on the job or at work. Sacred lovers, yeah, they may be going off to have lunch, lunch breaks, or whatever they're doing after lunch. Who knows, okay? But there's a feeling of insecurity that's coming in. Okay, all right, so I'm hearing single here. So someone may be choosing to be single or doing a single life, going to hotels here. Someone is choosing to, to go at the hotel and have a little fun time here, okay? I'm hearing on unrecruited love here or unrecruited relationship that is bringing in a plot. So someone's a plot about to do some kind of a plot. This could be somebody that you know. All right, so I'm getting late night, late night manipulation. All right, so this person is definitely hooking up here. And it's definitely causing insecurity here. For some of you feeling insecurity, or some of this, some of you just either feeling blocked. Either you feel like this person has blocked you, or this could be you blocking your own self because of your own insecurity. I feel like um, you know, somebody might have caught feelings here through text messages that's eventually bringing drama and seduction here. Tell me more. Let's see. All right, so there's a lot of lies that's coming in. So this person's wearing a mask. There's a lot of lies that's coming in. For some of you guys, you may be going through the phone, trying to find something out on the phone here. If this person is doing what they're doing, what your intuition is telling you that this person may be having an affair or whatever that could be. But I'm hearing a toxic connection here. It's a sex toxic connection, okay? That's affecting the family. I feel like, you know, you guys either would have wish come true with this relationship here, but at the end of the day, there's a decision that needs to be made here because of guilt. I'm hearing the ex, the ex cheated, the ex cheated, okay? I'm hearing somebody, maybe a womanizer here because this person flirts a lot, flirts a lot. But I hear that if you guys are even in separation or you had a, had a couple of separations already, there's been times where there had been reconciliation, Okay. Um, I do feel like there, there's some kind of a strategy that you may be coming up with as far as separation is concerned. I'm hearing um, someone may have caught feelings for real, okay? The feelings that were caught is that somebody um, 
this attached to um, a phone call here. Some kind of a phone call. Somebody might have even been caught in the act here. Not anymore. Yeah, you guys are not speaking right now. I'm feeling like there's something where two people is just not able to communicate right now. There's just so much going on with your connection, is what I'm hearing, Gemini, where two people maybe just can't see eye to eye at this moment. Tell me more. Clarify these messages, please, for Gemini, please. All right, so we have the Ace of Wands, the Six of Swords in the reverse, the Ace of Wands in the reverse, the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, and the Deck. All right, so someone is thinking that something better is out there, but at the end of the day, it's only causing anxiety. This anxiety is attached to either you or them because we have the Ace of Wands here in the reverse and the Six of Swords. So someone is making a decision to walk away from a situation here. Someone does not want to invest anything else further, moving on. Someone wants to end things. Someone doesn't even want to pray for somebody no more. Somebody's pissed off here because there's a lot of disagreements here. There's a lot of... Um, mixed signals, there's a lot of hurt, there's a lot of pain here. Someone is either dealing with some kind of a mind game or manipulation or this, the roles could be reversed because at the end of the day, there's a deck here that tells me that something needs to end. Something has to end here because it's unhealthy. It's an unhealthy cycle as coming in as you have given. You have given what you can. You trusted this person with your heart, soul, and body. But in the return, something someone is choosing to come in, but not coming in with true intentions here. The true intentions is needed to, in order for you to give this person a second chance. The three of swords, the page of swords in the reverse, and the lovers. So there's definitely this third party that's coming in as, I'm here. I'm here, okay? And this third party situation is very toxic. Really, really, really toxic. Very toxic. The King of Swords, the Eight of Pentacles in the reverse, the Page of Cups been here, and the Ten of Pentacles. So someone's about to make you some kind of an offer here. This is what I'm seeing. Something, someone is coming to towards you with something. This could be something from your job, something that has to do with money or making the decision about a position. That you're about to embark in. This king of swords. Someone is ready to fight for you here. Okay. Because your money is not going right. Somebody's money is not going right at this point. The five of swords in the reverse. Whatever is coming in with this negative energy. That has been blocked. Why is this here? Heartbreak. That's been blocked. The seven of cups in the reverse. The seven of wands also here. So whoever thought that there was other options, they ran out of that damn options. <laughs> okay? Because they're still struggling to find their way. With the devil here being here also in the reverse, whatever evil that was coming towards you, that's been blocked, okay? That's been blocked because God don't like ugly. The eight of ones here, the ten of cups in the reverse, somebody put an end to a dream here, but still causing some kind of a confusion here. Are yet needing to, um, to communicate. But what I see coming in with this ten of swords is that in the reverse is you're you're making peace with whatever it happened and you're moving forward and you're getting ready to embark on this eight this ace of cups the ace of cups the three of cups okay so you've been celebrating for what you really truly need here happiness the queen of cups the strength card in the reverse the queen of cups in the reverse the hierophant in the reverse the nine of swords also here there's a lot of healing that nine of swords in the reverse so you're healing from this you're walking away from that because somebody made a massive mistake here when they try to tap into your strength. All right, the queen of cups in the reverse, the high priestess. You're taking back your power. You're manifesting negativity away from you. The knight, the six of wands, the two of swords in the reverse. Mm -mm. Okay, the five of cups. So now they're feeling rather shame coming towards you with the six of wands here. But still unsure. They're yet to make a decision. The Five of Cups. The Five of Cups, the Four of Cups. The world in the reverse. 
There's a lot of uncertainty here. Because they know you know about this third party situation. I'm seeing drama that's coming in. The two of pentacles, you're blocking that. But they still attach this third party um, nonsense and stupidity here. That's really putting an end to the dream that could have been with you and them. The eight of swords, a lot of betrayal here. Someone is still struggling to find themselves out of a situation that they started in the first place. And this is why the two of cups is in the reverse. N nothing is going to change unless they fix that problem. The King of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles, and the reverse, the Tree of Wands here. So there's a decision that's still not been made yet. Okay? Not been made with the Three of Wands, not been made with the Page of Pentacles in the reverse, but the King of Pentacles wants to invest in you. This is new love that's coming in. Target that King of Pentacles, please. The Knight of Cups. Okay. Something brand new, honey. What is the Knight of Cups, please? Tell me more about this person. Okay, so they see you as the one, the queen of swords. Okay, so you manifested this person. Okay, you've thought about things, you're looking for, but see, you're looking for clarity, but they, so are they. All right, they know that you've been hurt and you've been damaged, the five of pentacles. They want to take away your pain because they see you struggle, okay? Yeah, they, they definitely want to invest in you. They want to invest their love and their heart in you, the king of cups. The king of cups of judgment, so... They're blocking, or this could be you that's blocking things to be with this person. You have to block a lot. You can't go with the, to this person with baggages, okay? The queen of wands, the king of wands in the reverse. That's cleaning the energy and cleansing the ear and manifesting brand new. Walking away from this tower moment here, but this person is still coming back because the six of cups is also here. All right, the nine of cups also here. There's definitely, and this in the reverse. So whatever what is expected from this person coming back to the, from the Six of Cups, the Nine of Cups, because it's in the reverse, this person is definitely not ready to give you anything or to invest into anything. They're still trapped. Still needed to make a decision there. Okay. All right, my darling, this is going to be your read, Gemini. Um, I hope that it did resonate with you guys. Please do not hesitate to... Give the reads a thumbs up. If you do need to have a prayer request, please let me know that you need one. See if I'm leaving your initials down below. Um, pray for me as I'm praying for you. And with that said, always remember to seek first and you always find. Bye, guys.